Hello, Miles from the Highview team here. Uh, we're going to go through editing user details as well as adding an alias uh, within the G Suite admin panel. Uh, so this helps answer questions such as um, how do I change someone's name or how would I change their primary email account, which are two common questions you might get from your users. So let's go ahead and jump right into the admin panel here. I'm selecting the users tab and from the users tab I'm going to click on the profile of an individual user and then navigate down to account. From this page here you'll see some basic information such as first name, last name, and their email address. Now I can simply click edit and maybe we spelled uh, Johnson wrong. Maybe his name wasn't actually Johnson or maybe it had some unusual spelling such as no age. Uh, and then maybe we want to change the primary email address. We set it up as Matthew.Johnson, but maybe Matt actually wants it Johnson M at domain. So I've made those changes and now I'm clicking update user. Now, whenever you change the primary uh, email address, that email address, the old one, is automatically added as an alias. Um, this is to help ensure email delivery because there might be people in the organization already sending to that email address that you've now changed. So in this case, Matthew Johnson's name and email address have been updated, Johnson M at domain. This is new primary email. And then if you scroll down here a little bit further, you'll see a section titled aliases. And you'll see Matt has several set up here at the moment. I could add an additional alias. I simply click add an alias and insert a name here. Maybe in this case, we want Matt to actually manage um, sales um, at centralcoastrealestateco.com. Uh, and this could be an alias that he could send and receive from. Uh, you will likely want to use the Google Groups feature for a function such as sales at, um, but let's say this is a, uh, a very small organization and Matt's going to be handling all sales. He technically could set it up as an alias under, under his uh, account. Okay, so from here we'll click save and that is the basics of changing essential user details and adding an alias in the G Suite admin console. Thank you.